Hey, what's up all my Madden lovers and Madden freaks? It's the one they call Top Diggity Dog, and I've just made a video compiling a list of my Madden NFL 2018 wish list. But after I made that video, I started thinking about other things, and I want to bring that to you guys' attention. All right, let's get into it. One thing I forgot to mention is uh, about the catching mechanic. Please fix the catching mechanic known as the aggressive catch, guys. Please fix that. Now, it was cool when y'all first added this to the game. Y'all put in the, the, the rack catch. Y'all put in the, the possession catch. And y'all put in the, the aggressive catch. It was pretty cool. And the aggressive catch was the Odell Beckham one-hand highlight catch. We loved it for that. But at the same time, it's getting a little old now, getting a little played out. Like me, I find myself hitting triangle a lot just to be able to jump up and make a catch on the ball. You know, I just want my receiver to really jump up and make that catch. Um, it's I don't want him to go for a position catch. I don't want him to just go for it, just, okay, I caught it. I want him to just jump up and say, no, I'm going to be aggressive. I'm going to catch this ball. However, I find that receiver most of the time either just putting one hand up or he's already going after the cornerback. Like he expects the cornerback is going to intercept the ball and he's already trying to make a tackle on the on the cornerback. Like stay away from the whole scripting thing, EA. I mean, I know, it, it, you know, you, your game is based off codes and stuff, but we want the game to not play out like we already know he's going to go ahead and accept that, you know, intercept that ball. We don't want that. <laughs> we want something that's a little bit much more fluid, you know. And for my receiver to go ahead and not even look back when the icon over his head is visible, because if you guys didn't know, if the if the uh, icon over your receiver's head is kind of like ghosted, that means he's not ready to be able to turn around and look for that ball. He's still running his route. So when my icon is there, he should be all right. I know, you know, I'm, I'm looking back for the ball, but if he do not look back for the ball, and he's already up. Oh, the cornerback's going to catch it, and he's already going for the tackle. I already know, up oh, this ball's about to get picked, and that's a problem for me. Another thing that I don't want to see in Madden 2018 is the motion glitch, because if you guys didn't know, Madden uh, 17 has something called the motion glitch, which means you can take a receiver, you can motion him to the left or the right. You can take, you know, you can motion. It's a, a lot of plays where you can just motion someone, and Bam, you're going to have somebody open. It, it's going to happen. It's, it's going to happen. It happens a lot in Madden NFL 17. So hopefully they fix that. I'm pretty sure they've seen it and they're going to fix it. But I just wanted to say, hopefully I don't see it in Madden NFL 18 or I'm going to be pissed. All right, next thing, last thing I want to talk about really for the most part is ranked sim play. Now, you might be asking me, okay, Top, what is ranked sim play? I'm uh, like, what do you mean by this? And I call it ring sim play because I really don't have another name for it. But uh, what ring sim play would be is what it would do is it would allow all the real Madden NFL sim players to play an actual Madden sim type game. Meaning it will make you go for things, you know, it'll make you do things uh, like how it used to do on the previous on, on like Pla uh, PlayStation 2. I remember Madden 2004 made you do it. Madden 2005 made you do it. I think Madden 2006 made you do it. When you tried to play an online ranked game, it made you kick, uh, punt the ball on certain situations. If it's inches, sometimes they say, yeah, you can go for it. But most of the time, other than that, they'll make you kick the ball. Uh, they'll make you do a kickoff and study uh, an onside kick. You know, because let's face it, man, a lot of times we as sim players, we play people on in ranked games. Sometimes we play them. And they go for every single onside kick. They go for every single fourth down. And, and, you know, sometimes it get annoying. A lot of people don't like to see that. So that's what I'm talking about. In this mode that uh, I would like to see, too, within, within ranked sim play is for uh, people to have that option to be like, no, uh-uh. I want to play a ranked sim game. And it'll make them, you know, make their opponent play the game just like how it was actually drawn up and meant to be played. And for all you guys going top, man, I you know, but it's not that it's kind of not realistic because I want my opponent to do what he feels, whatever you know, because that's stupid on his point if he don't get it, you know, if he don't get it, then then you know I got the ball on some good field position, and that's cool. But I'm saying this will be an option. This will just be another option, another little game mode, or you know, whatever a stipulation that someone can add to what type of ranked game they want to play, you know that, and I think that'd be cool to be there. 
Another thing that I forgot to mention, and probably the most th the most important thing that I forgot to mention in my last video, is Madden needs to be added to the PC, man. I, uh, I don't know what EA's doing. I don't know how long they've been sleeping, but they've been sleeping for a long time because I've been I've been keeping my eyes looking at the forums for a while. I've been hearing a lot of feedback and a lot of PC gamers want to play Madden, but they can't do it. They got to go, you know, they got to have an Xbox. They got to have a PlayStation, you know. They can't play it. And that is what's kind of failing for Madden as well. So Madden needs to be brought to the PC, man. Show the PC gamers some love. Be able to put your games uh, game game on that platform uh, and maybe they don't want to do it because they know it's going to get modded <laughs> maybe EA's like no my game going to get modded I don't want to do it because I know it's going to get modded and if that's the case guys bite the bullet <laughs> and bite the bullet yeah uh, all the games end up getting modded when they get put on the PC but at the same time guys you're still going to have a lot of good uh, good, uh, a good community for the PC a lot of great players and another thing when I said about on my last video about bringing the PlayStation VR and then Microsoft, whatever they're working on, uh, to you know, for Madden, uh, Oculus Rift and uh, the Valve and all like that, man. Shoot, PC has that stuff hands down, great. And then they have the great, the, the best graphic card and all that other stuff that they buy out there. So, man, show some love to the PC gamers. Put a lot of people like to see Madden on the PC. All right, and that's all I want to say, guys. I forgot to mention that in my previous video. Um, make sure you check it out. By the way, here's a link right here. Go check it out. I'm telling you, I covered a lot of great things in, uh, in that video. And uh, guys, yeah, yep, yep. And make sure you go ahead, throw your comments down. If you have anything you would like to see in Madden NFL 18 or any of the future Maddens, please put it down in the comments below. It's the one they call Top Diggity Dog. I'm out. Deuces.